Constantine was a very historic city. Um, this visit has highlighted for me uh, its very big role in uh, the mechanical sector, in the, in the agricultural sector, in the uh, medicament, the pharmaceutical sector. Um, and I think that those are all areas that uh, have potential for great partnership with the United States. And that's what I want to take back and try to, uh, uh, to, to share with uh, American companies and see what sort of partnerships we can find. Mr. Ambassador, I have a couple of questions. Uh, first, you have declared uh, recently that uh, you, you will open a new uh, airline uh, direct airline between Algeria and uh, the USA. Uh, what is the new about this project? Uh, my second question, uh, the, the de uh, deputy coordinator for council tourism, uh, Aline Romanowski, declared that uh, uh, Algeria and USA will sign a bilateral agreement about uh, uh, anti-terrorism. Uh, can you give us more details about this, about this agreement? Well, uh, uh, I'm sorry. The first the first question was about the um, airline. Oh, the airline, right? Yeah. Uh, so uh, 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 we are in discussion with um, the Algerian government and the Algerian authorities about uh, direct flights, Air Algeria direct flights to New York. Um, uh, that is uh, a discussion that's underway. It's uh, it's a it's a complicated process, but it is. Uh, you know, there's no, there's no fundamental barrier to it. It, it takes, uh, there's a lot of agencies that have to be involved, aviation safety, transportation safety, our Federal Aviation Administration, the Algerian Civil Aviation Administration. And so there's a lot of discussions back and forth that have to take place among experts. And we're working with our Algerian counterparts now in Algiers about how we make those arrangements. So it's not something that happens overnight, but I'm optimistic that uh, we're having good discussions about it. It will take some time but I think that we will get there. Um, as far as Ms. Romanowski's visits, we have very good cooperation with, uh, uh, with our Algerian partners on, on regional issues and on the security um, uh, issues in the region. I'm not sure exactly what, um, specifically when you talk about agreements, what you have in mind, um, but we do work together very continuously and our communication is very good. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm, comp I'm confident that we will be able to, to keep working together into the future. So thank you. Mr. Ambassador, Thanks. can you, just one question, if you will permit. Uh, recently, in relation with the security mm. situation, recently The Intercept has uh, published a piece of investigation. Sorry, the, the, the Intercept, ah, okay. yeah, a piece of uh, paper relating the intervention, the NATO intervention in Libya with uh, the Manchester uh, terror attack. Uh, did you consider that uh, the NATO intervention in Libya was a mistake, as some states and some leaders have <laughs> said that? My second question, we have learned that uh, you, 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 are, you would be in Constantine in early February, but your uh, trip to Constantine was uh, scheduled or uh, delayed due to uh, security matters or to a planning uh, of your own. <laughs> Uh, well, uh, wow. I, I, anyway, I mean, uh, um, I've been able to get to see a number of cities in the country, uh, including Oran and Taman Rasset. I'm glad to, to get to Constantine. I yeah. uh, hope to travel to more. Um, uh, and of course, that, uh, that is my focus now. Um, I, I don't see really any value into getting a historical discussion about Libya. And I'm not familiar with the uh, intercepts. What's Manchester your uh, assessment, Mr. Thank you. 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 Th